Hello again, everybody. This is Mr. Everything, and I'm coming back at you with another IL-2 Boat and Plata career. We are flying uh, in the 494th Fighter Squadron with P-47s. Looks like it's going to be a fairly cold day. All right, let's take a look at... HQ, that's all of us right there. And then we got a planning room. I guess it's October 11th. I'm flying in the morning. We're doing a vehicle column attack. All right, let's go ahead and start the mission. All right, looks like we're going to be flying up here towards Wassenberg. And we're going to attack... Uh, what are we going to attack? Early in the morning, right? Um, transport column. Okay. So let's go ahead and do a setup. I uh, have thought about it. I th thought to myself, I should probably fly with more of a default style paint scheme. That's what, that's what I'm thinking until I earn something. But we're going to do, we're going to change it over from official to custom. I think the MX is the one I was actually thinking about. We're going to use that one until I get some kind of rank. Okay. But uh, gun wise, and bomb wise, and rocket wise, that all seems good. But I'm going to change my convergence from 200. I'm going to push it out even further. So my machine guns are almost firing straight out. I think this goes to 800, right? Looks like it'd go to 1,000, yeah. Uh, I heard a lot of people did seven th 700. Um, I'm going to do five. I'm going to split the difference. 10 seconds is good, even though their vehicle's moving, possibly. I should probably give them um, 5 seconds. And I'm going to change this. I got two 5,000, I'm sorry, two five, three five hundreds and some rockets. That should be fine for, uh, that should be fine for soft vehicles. So we'll see. All right, here we are on the airfield. Lined up. Ready to go. Let's give myself a little bit of flap. rudder left rudder get on the straight away nose it down a little bit nose it down left rudder there we go and I got pretty heavy left rudder All right, we're going to autopilot, and then we're going to uh, take a couple of scenes from the outside. For the uh, beginning of the video. advance time and when we get to the objective I'll be right back. 
All right, we're pretty close to the objective. We're about 12 miles out. Uh, we're in formation with our guys. We've got a couple of guys back here. Got a couple of guys up there. Uh, now, there's something I found out, or maybe I'm just, maybe I'm just reading into it. But normally what I do is I break away from the formation and I go in and I attack the objective and then I blow up whatever needs to be blown up vehicles planes buildings whatever and then the AI says oh mission objective complete okay let's go home so I'm not going to do that this time this time I'm going to kind of fly around a little bit maybe not do any attacking and waiting for my squadron here my flight to actually do some attacking and then once they start the actual attacking, then I'll jump in and blow some stuff up. Basically, it'll allow them to get some kills. We'll score better as a as a war effort and things like that. Okay, so I'm going to turn the autopilot off when we hit five. Uh, and then I'm going to fly around on my own. Let me hit the autopilot. Boop, it's hit. Now I'm going to leave my, th where's my throttle? 40? Okay, we're going to put it closer to 50. You can see the line of trucks. I don't know. Can you see them? Maybe you can't see them. Okay, it's no worries. Let's back up now. Okay, nope. Okay. Oh, now you can see them right there along the tree line. Well, a couple of them are going in. I hope they actually go in and attack. Oh, I see some rockets going. Nice. Okay, we got some kills. So what that means is I need to do kind of the same thing. So I'm going to line up with one of these roads over here so that I overshoot or if I undershoot, I'll actually maybe hit a vehicle. I don't like going perpendicular. Okay, it's a curved road. Hmm, it's going to be a tricky one. Oh, wait, I want to drop some flaps. Maybe not a whole lot, but just a little bit. 25% sounds good to give me a little lift if I get close to that ground. Okay, another one's going in. Nice. Okay, it's a zigzaggy road, so that's kind of good for them. Should have came in on this. Uh, okay, this is a good spot. Let's just do this. Okay, rocket time. Did I get something? I don't think I got anything. Ground ahead? Yeah. I am not retracting my flaps. Okay, maybe a little bit. That's enough. Keep it at 20%. That sounds good. Okay, bombs. Let's open up our little pickle, pickle switch. I got three 500 pound bombs. I'm gonna hit on that long curve right there. That's the plan. 
<clears throat> yeah, right in this general vicinity. Put my thumb on the right correct button. Okay. Because I've pressed the wrong buttons in the past. Ah, perfect, perfect. No, it wasn't perfect. Dang. Why did my plane do this? It slipped. Okay, let's go. Let's do this again. Look at that swamp. All right, something got destroyed. That's good. I'm trying to line up with that curve right there. Ah, here we go. This looks like it might be a good good opportunity. Why slip to the right, dude? Come on. Stop it. Oh, these guys are stopped. Yeah, I didn't think I hit anything. For some reason, I'll get around and then the plane will keep sliding to one side or the other. Yeah, I got an Opal Blitz. Oh, we got fighters. Let me get my last bomb dropped. Couple of fighters. Trace around, what's going on? Wait, where'd the guy go there? Was, ah, there he is. Sven von Trescow, or whatever his name is. That's not who I'm going after, but... Come on, I got my should have my throttle fully fully fold. You know what I mean? And I got my 
convergence out there too. see anybody I was chasing that dude it's not used up all my ammo you know what I mean Oh, I got a couple of hits. Got a, got a little bit on him. Oh, got a little bit more. Got a little bit of the wing on that one. Oh, I got some more. Man, I'm going full out. <laughs> got some hits. Got some really serious lead on the guy. Boom, look at that. I think my 500 meter convergence is really helping. Oh no, okay. Okay. Oh, he must have seen it. Southwest, half mile. Bring the engine down just a little bit so I don't burn it up. That's home. Or towards home, I should say. I'm 
going north. Up oh, there's the rest of the okay there they are. Just trying to get some altitude, which equals energy, so we can actually do some dogfighting. Unless, of course, they got him. I didn't hear, like, a splash. There we go. He's, he's still there. How did they know I was engaging the fighter? Okay, this altitude is going to help me with my energy bleed. Come on, Klaus, I'm on you. How much lead? How much? Oh, there are two of them! Nope, not enough lead. I knew that. Speed is low, I know, I'm nosing it down. Oh, we're over friendly lines. Those are friendly troops down there. Did I get him? Oh. Okay. But there was a second one. it's that way. Either way, I'm getting closer to our uh, allies. I look back like that, but I have a mirror, but yeah. Yep, friendly lines. Got some friendly troopers right over there. Do I have a friendly plane around here somewhere? I thought he did. Oh, there he is. Old Frank Brown. Let's go to continuous. Is he falling in with me? I think he might be. All right, guys, well, what I'm going to do is, because I don't see any hostiles in the area. Nope. Well, then again, somebody's engaging somebody, and he said he was close. 
Wait, I got a friend over there flying. A couple of them. I think I'm in a circle. join my homies, you know what I mean? Maybe the three of us can make it. Okay. Alright, we're up in the seventh going to base. The rest of our guys are there. They came back for us. All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hit autopilot reform with my team and then we will fly back to base. So, um, I'll see you when we get there. All right, we're almost back. We've got the uh, airfield like right there. All right, and that's where we're heading. And uh, I'm gonna turn autopilot off and I'm gonna throttle down and I'm gonna orbit slowly. Now I'm going to turn my landing lights on. I think L is for that, right? That's auto level. Okay, never mind. What did I put my lights at? O? Yep, landing lights on. There we go. Alright. Flight Roughman. That's us. That's our entire group. Okay, Joel. Wait, Joel, were you the leader when we started this mission? Hold on here. Yep, Joel was the leader. Speed's actually at a good speed to lower some flaps, so. It's also going to slow my, my velocity down. See, I don't see my lights on. Oh, wait. I got like a flashlight. Hmm. Okay, interesting. Maybe it's navigation lights. Landing lights, navigation lights. Now let's see. Oh yeah, now they're on. Yep, okay. So that's how we're going to do it.
Excuse me, I just sneeze. Oh, Ruffman 7's already landed. Nice. Just telling him to clear the runway. Antonio Wilson. Taking it easy. We're not like we're not rushing this thing. I'm coming. Watch this. Landing gear down. Not lined up. Drop my flaps like mad, man. Okay. Too bad, I'm coming in. No, what the hell's going on with my plane? I'm landing in the grass. Off. I'm getting off the air runway. I'm clearing it. Who are these guys?
cutting it off. All right, guys, so that's the end of the mission. Let's see what happens. All right, I got two transports and two light airplanes, 109s. Hey, I've been awarded the Air Medal. Nice. And a Silver Star Oak Leaf Cluster. Wow, two medals. Boom, boom. Okay, let's... let's uh finish the next mission looks like oh what we had two people killed okay we had nathaniel clark killed frank brown killed and then we got charles williams killed uh and victor got injured okay now let me see something here these were vehicles okay so antonio got a bunch samuel only those two got any vehicles and i'm the only one with any airplanes Hmm. And here, they got a couple of vehicles. He got a vehicle and died. Dang it. Okay. We're going to go to the next day. Okay, it looks like we're going to do a free hunt when I come back. Okay, so I'll see that mission in the next video. See you then.